Look at that. They just busted the glass using a pickaxe. And now they're going to apply this weird magic product. They just spread it all over the cracked area and it simply vanishes. No way. Let's go test it now. So we have our pickaxe and our glass too. I always wanted to do this. I want to do it again. Just because it was satisfying. And now our magical product. Here we go, Ramon. Check it out. We have enough for the whole windshield. Apparently my team decided to buy two of them. Just to make sure. It's called Eel Hole. I just wonder what the heck does it mean. But I really don't want to find out. Clean the glass. Then use the glue. Wait for it to dry. Then scrape off the excess glue with the blade. Give it a final polish. And they promise the glass is going to be as good as new. There it is. Check it out. It also comes with these small pieces of plastic. There's this razor blade as well. And a little cap. So for the first step, we're going to clean up a small area. We're going to do this because I don't want to spend too much time when I'm not sure if this really works or not. But if it does work, this glass will be completely restored as if nothing happened. Now let's dry it with a cloth because the surface has to be 100% clean. There you go. You can see how bad it is, right Ramon? Mm -hmm. So here we go. Take a good look because it's not gonna last long. All right, let's open it up. It already comes with a little application nozzle. Wait, what is that smell? <laughs> it smells like that resin we use with styrofoam. Crazy stuff. Let's see it. Look at that. It's like a gel. Let's put some more over here. Is it working? The crack is supposed to vanish. No, mm. I think you have to use that tape now. I suppose it'll act like some sort of seal. I'm going to put it here so it can hold the gel in place right on top of the glass. Now over here, we're gonna pick up our blade. Now take a closer look right here. There are some tiny bubbles. Let's use a razor to scrap it off. And now we have to wait for this to dry out, right? Now it might take a little while to completely dry out, but take a closer look at this. As soon as I remove the excess, all of these imperfections will vanish. And to do so, I'm gonna take the razor to remove this little plastic with the excess glue. I think they're forming a single layer. Wait a second, there are two layers? Well, look at that. It's crystal clear. Nice. My goodness, really? I cannot feel any sign of the crack over here where we applied the glue. Well, of course in the ad, they're doing some tricks with the angle of the camera to hide it out. If you look from underneath, you can see the glass is still broken. And the reason is because the glass broke completely through. So the glass is uneven. It's never going to be 100% flat again. But if the windshield has only superficial damage, you can do a good repair job because the product works perfectly. So as you can see, Ramon, the longer we live, the more we can realize everything is a matter of perspective.